I'll head out to engineering to build something. Dark thrower. And uh, uplink targeting. Okay, let's do it. I'm gonna put um, uplink uh, arc thrower on this guy. Next deployment site is in the UK. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan. Central, Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there. Oh, this is a disturbing sight to say the least. It's hard to differentiate where the organic material ends and the machine begins. It's not going to win any beauty contests, that's for sure. Nice job. But that's just two of them, right? There's a third, I think. Well, there is a third, I saw it clearly. Hostiles pacified. At least I got one body and weapon fragments. There's someone inside there, I guess.
Oh, fuck. Oh, crap. Whoa! That was certainly close. Now look, I don't want to actually kill this guy. All right. Hmm. I'll get him next time. Sleep tight. Excellent. Now we can begin preparing for the interrogation. Why? Never mind. I just hope none of my guys dies. That's certainly a victory. position. I don't think we're alone out here. Shut up. Listen.
Mhm. Nice. Black spikes, don't we just love them? Yeah, I managed to kill the guy inside here. Sit now down. I'm gonna do suppression on this guy and hope he misses his next, next thing. That's what he does. Your move. Operational objectives complete. Good job. Mission complete. Panic in China. Panic in India. Panic in Australia. Panic in Canada. Panic in the whole fucking world. This situation is getting out of hand. It wasn't easy, but this could really be a turning point in our research. Not only can we interrogate the subject, but bringing an alien back alive provides us with a much better understanding of their physiology. <sighs> Impressive work indeed. Preparations in the containment facility are well underway. We will be in touch, Commander.
This is really bad. I need to reduce the... Yeah. We should begin interrogating the alien subject immediately. I'm confident we can safely house it within the containment facility, but I can't say for how long. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. The more I see, the more I don't want to see. That twisted hulk of flesh and metal, driven by the alien technology, can we still call that life? We have to keep moving forward with the project, but the thought of treading the same path as the aliens is... troubling. What if they were like us once? Are we just part of a continuing cycle? If this is a glimpse of our future, I want no part of it. Ah, nice. Yeah, I'll get three satellites, actually. So, how'd it go, well, Doctor? Better than expected. Before the creature expired, I was able to extract some new information from it. You're saying that thing spoke to you? Not precisely. But when you have access to a creature's brain, certain patterns can be discerned, recent images and thoughts. And what exactly was our late friend thinking about? This particular image appeared in the creature's thought patterns several times throughout the procedure. We've already met that thing, Doctor. This is hardly the kind of breakthrough we were- And there was a neural link in the creature's mind between this image and this one. That's the thing that pulled a disappearing act when we shot down our first UFO. And let me guess, you want to poke around in its head too. It is the next piece of the puzzle. And this time, instead of shooting it, I suggest we try to capture it alive. We shall see. We've assembled everything we need to capture and house an alien for inter- Commander, we've got another contact. The signature is a little bigger this time, though. Okay, Costine here, signing out. <laughs>